do well with the character. But overall, it's he's difficult to pilot. Like his la he has some of the worst frame data in the game overall. Then again, Samus is not necessarily a speed demon herself. This is a bit of a battle of zoners, so we'll see how it shapes up. At the very least, Samus does outrange Pro. <laughs> okay. Oh, is this All regular right. Samus? It is. Wait, oh my. You're right. It is regular Whoa. Samus. Yeah, you gotta opt for for Spider Man. Like, come on. <laughs> But anyway, can we? I, I completely glossed over the fact that that first stock disappeared in an instant. An amazing combo from Dank just opening out the gates. Will seems at a loss right now. This piranha plant. All right, I like this idea of taking center stage. Uh, Literally attacking <laughs> from center stage. Yeah, no, I, I, I did say that uh, Samus outranges piranha plant uh, with one notable exception the big old chomp chomp from, yeah. uh, you know, which can reach from across stages, I think. If somebody's on the other setup, you can hit him. Oh, and he just gets him. Throws out that charge shot, it connects, and now we have a three to one stock advantage. Dank is looking really clean right now, just getting more and more damage in. Oh, this is looking like a, <laughs> this game one at least is gonna be wrapped up pretty soon. Oh, okay though, Dank is a kind of getting a bit antsy, you know, when you, are ahead by quite a bit, and you maybe start to underestimate your opponent, you go, okay, the bomb exploded in from that far away, me. But you can underestimate your opponent, and you start throwing out kind of more risky options. I'm talking yeah. specifically about the up B he just kind of YOLO'd with. Uh, all right, but that up B, a little bit less YOLO, YOLO, just a very quick punish. I love that spot dodge, and using the uh, increased hurtbox size from that move to punish him with a down tilt, and that back air is finishing it off. All right, really good game one from Dank. Did he lose a stock? I do not think he did. So, even though I've never heard of him before, that first stock in particular, that was just a, that was a, that was the grinder. Mm-hmm. So Dank gonna be getting rid of Unova and Kalos. Uh, I'm actually not quite sure which are Piranha Plant's best stages. That might be a comfort pick sort of thing, or a comfort ban, rather. Uh, but regardless, we also might see a character switch. Uh, it felt like Piranha Plant just couldn't keep up with Samus. You know, there, there I think, was that character aspect, the outranging, like the fact that he could hit him with these down tilts and forward airs and back airs. But it seems that Piranha Plant is his character, and he is sticking to it. So, moving into game two, I wonder what adjustments he can make. Oh, but he did counterpick. Sorry, Dank counterpicked to the, the dankest color of Samus. This is Dark Samus. No, this is regular Samus. No, that's now Dark Samus. Wait, now it's Dark Samus. Now it's Dark Samus. He's like, th uh, he's throwing everyone for a loop. You can always tell by the Spider-Man jump oh, that yeah. Dark Samus makes. You gotta love it. I also love that grab being used from so far away. You know, Piranha Plant does have armor on that downbeat. At least uh, when it comes to the pot Ooh. part of it. Oh, when he just hits him with the charge shot again. I'm also liking the movement from Dank. Oh, I think he wanted that. Probably a bar backer to connect. That might have killed. But in the meantime, finally getting a hit in. Oh, he is hungry for that down B. He keeps going for it. And then he manages to connect it. But okay, and I will say game one, this is when he was starting to do his best, when he just took center stage and held it confidently. And that is what he's doing right now. Actually, Will has almost taken this first stock. And he, oh man, still alive. Samus is just too heavy that, even though that move might be one of the better finishes, I can't believe he's, this edge guard is still going on. All right, I was, I was a little bit, you know, in my heart of hearts, writing off Will, but that was just so clean. But a pretty clean answer from Dank to respond. That's going to be a charge shot to even things up. But I think that at the very least, that momentum is left up. You know, finally, yeah. Will has, seems to be breathing his own. And especially if he's a newer player, that makes a lot of sense. You know, somebody who is probably their first time on stream, they get dunked on that very first <gasps> game. <laughs> Yo, he broke his shield. Okay, charge up the thing. Oh, he, I think he probably could have uh, gotten a little bit of um, poison damage in there. Oh, so, yeah, definitely. He Although, if he didn't have the poison already charged, he probably didn't want to waste any time. But still. I mean, he had time, though. You know? It's, yeah. it's just a little bit more damage, and that might have been... I mean, you never know when that bit mm -hmm. of percent is yeah. what's going to end up making the difference. Because right now, Dank, despite...
kind of getting rocked that first stock. He's put himself back in the driver's seat. He's had only taken 64%, and this is that game plan we saw in game one where he's using the range that Samus has over Piranha Plant to just do more and more damage. A forward air putting him off stage. All right, I actually like the fact that he's not trying to get greedy. Uh, you know, I feel like in game one he was maybe doing a little bit of that, and now you see that he's not messing around off stage at all, just taking one out of Will's book and just trying to use stage positioning to his advantage. Okay, that trade is actually going to work out for Will. He has the stage positioning once again. Oh, I love the Zare to come down. That's a move. Okay, as I say, he wasn't getting too anxious about it. He does go off stage. Doesn't suffer too badly for it. In fact, I think that... Oh, he's just a recovery. Ah, I love the idea behind that high recovery, but Samus's charge shot just reaches... It, it reaches across the map, you know? Mm -hmm. Just sticking with him. Finishes the job. That's going to be Dank moving on in bracket. So we're going to get more Dank in bracket. Maybe even more on stream. We'll see how he fares. Uh,